Всем привет из Тарасвете из Новой Зеландии. Welcome back to another video. Now, as you can see here, there is a lot of photos on the table. And these are photos all from my childhood, from me coming to New Zealand when I was two years old. And what I've got here is two photo albums. I'm going to fill them up with photos of my life for both my birth mother and my birth father, because I believe it is very important for me to connect with them in this way and share photos of my life and just show them the childhood that I had. There's a lot of photos here. Photos of my life, photos of my childhood, me growing up, me coming to New Zealand when I was two years old. I've even got a few photos from me in the orphanage as well. And I'm going to make a photo album for both my birth mother and my birth father. And I've got these two photo albums here and I've written down Maya Jizen, which means my life. And I really wanted to send photos as a gift to both of my birth parents. There's also some photos that I'm going to be putting in here of me meeting them as well, because that's also an important part of my life. And I think it's going to be... It's going to be awesome. So as you can see, there's a lot of photos here. The first photo I chose, though, was a photo of me in the actual orphanage in Archangel. Now, this is showing me, obviously, as a two-year-old, and um, to me, it's, <laughs> it's where everything started for me. So I've started adding a few photos already. It's not in any specific exact timeline, but it is a lot of photos that does show what my childhood was like for both of my birth parents. And I'm just going to start filling it up and just letting them know that this is... This is me, this is my life, this is important, and this is, this is what my life was like. And I just want to show that respect to both of my birth parents because they wanted to see what my life was like. They've asked so many questions, both my birth mother and my birth father about my childhood, and there's so many photos. There's some embarrassing photos, and <laughs> I won't show too many of them, but just growing up, you know, I was a musical person. I, it, I remember starting school for the first time and you know even kindergarten for the first time and it's just things like this so my brother and i we we both went to school at the same time and man a lot of good memories and my childhood was good i had a great childhood a lot of it is with due to the way that my parents raised me i'm very thankful and grateful for that i love my parents so my brother and i started school when we were both five years old and yeah, we were in the same class a lot of the times. It didn't change much. It didn't, you know, I had a great childhood in that regard. And everything was new for me. My school, everything. Um, it was just a big part of my life. Trying to understand everything in the world. My mum and dad taught us a lot. I had a great, a lot of great birthdays. It was, um, yeah, it was, it was a childhood definitely to remember. I had a great childhood, really. Now I'm not going to go through every single photo and explain every single one of them because there's 140 <laughs> that I'm sending through. But a lot of the photos, I just want to really say, um, they mean a lot to me. They're important parts of my life. And I don't actually know exactly what age all of these photos <laughs> were taken, but it's about just, you know, sharing as much of my life to my birth parents as I can because I believe to myself that's, that's a big part of me. Um, it's a big part of my life, a big part of everything. But this is my first day at school, I believe. Um, Thomas the Tank Engine. Thomas the Tank Engine. Put that in there. <laughs> um, <laughs> it was just... When I was growing up, my parents took a lot of photos. All the time. The film camera. Ching, ching, ching. By the way, I do have one of those film cameras myself now. And it's, I love it. It is awesome. It is such a great camera. It's, it's old. Yes, it's old school, but it's, it's so cool to have that. Um, and it's such a, you know, a throwback. It's a throwback, man. It's a throwback. Let's put that in there. It's a throwback. This is cool. That's, we went on a family trip there back in the 90s there. So I've also got photos here of me meeting my birth parents for the first time as well as me revisiting Russia and meeting them as well. So I've got my birth mother meeting her several times and my birth father because that, that's me, that's part of me. So when I was a child, my mum was raised on a farm and we went to the farm, my grandparents lived there. And I've decided to get copies of all of this just to show a lot of the New Zealand culture side in my family. We used to go out on the farm quite a lot. It was awesome, it was great. I just remember it very clearly. Um, I had a bowl cut. Me and my brother, my brother and I, we had bowl cuts. Um, here's the, here is, all, there's a lot of photos, a lot of more photos than I thought there would be. <laughs> I, did, I didn't realize exactly how many photos I got. I printed these all out today. I scanned them all, I went, did some throwbacks. I just scanned some old photos because it is, it is important. 
it is, it's big. It's big for me and um, I'm very, very proud to be doing this for both of my birth parents. So we'll get through these. We'll get through these one, one step at a time. Look how cute me and my brother were. So young and, you know, to know what was ahead of us. To have things like this is special and to share photos like this. It's, um, I know my birth mother and my birth father will appreciate this because there's a lot of stuff that was, you know, that they haven't seen of my life. And it's just about really opening up my life to theirs. And this is why I'm doing this. I wanna say also thank you to you guys for following everything I do. Um, how I'm trying to spread the word around about why connecting with my birth parents was important. Everybody has a different, again, everyone has a different way of viewing that in their lives and that's perfectly fine. But growing up, I always was wondering about Russia. I was always curious about where I come from. Um, and to me, you can see these in the photos. You can see the whole, <laughs> oh, these boys, are these boys Russian? Are these boys twins? Because me and my brother looked like twins. And um, yeah, to me, it's, it's a big part of my life. And this is why, I, and my birth parents have not seen photos like this. I send the occasional photo to my birth father, but my birth mother, she's never, she's only seen a few photos of me growing up. And I really wanted to kind of surprise her and, and let her know that I am thinking of her quite often. My birth mother brought me into this world. And so to this, to do this is, is why I'm doing it because I just have a lot of respect for her. No matter how she lives her life, um, I just have a lot of respect for her and I, I do love her. I love my birth mother and my birth father and having this as a special gift for them is, I'm very, very thankful to be able to do this and send this through to them. So it's, it's awesome. Doing this, I've always wanted to do this, do a life photo album for both my birth parents because it is a big part of me and um, yeah, it's my life. Moya Jezen. So let's continue on. <laughs> Look at this, awesome. So this is going to my birth mother and then I'm gonna finish the one for my birth father. But you know, it's gonna be exactly the same sort of, it's the same photos. <laughs> so I won't go through all of that all again, but thank you so much for watching this. And I just really wanna thank all of you guys for your support, for watching my journey, watching my YouTube channel, watching my videos and learning about my story. Now please go ahead and check me out on social media. I am on there and there's more videos to come. Meanwhile, I'm gonna finish the second one of this and I'm gonna send these off to Russia tomorrow and get them away to both my birth mother and birth father. And I know that they, they will appreciate this and I'm very thankful for being able to do this, getting it out there and sharing my life story to them in photos. Thank you so much. Spasiba Bushoe. It does a Danny is Novozelandi. Ipaka paka. Spasiba.